Yesterday, actually, we put out two names. One was ITC, the other was Escorts. Uh, so Escorts is the one that I want to just revisit. Uh, it, the stock ended up about 5% in a market which was down and out. Uh, it was Escorts basically, it's the same chart. It's just been updated for yesterday's scandal, which is the last one, which is a meaningful one. Uh, so the question uh, is, 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 is it taken support? I mean, we were asking the question whether it's a make or break time for uh, Escorts. With yesterday's candle, can we say it's made, it's made it? Uh, I still don't have the answer, but I think uh, it did take support exactly at that level. We put it out before market opened yesterday. It took support exactly at, this, at the trend line and then gave you a 5% move. The high, by the way, was 21.28. It closed off the high at about 20.75, which is the uh, close yesterday. This is also interesting because, I mean, we heard this call on m and Sonia put out the call on Mahindra, another tractor maker, also a tractor maker. Uh, which where CLSA, I think, has upgraded their uh, call. Maybe we can have the M&M uh, sort of chart as well and put both of these to uh, Mitesh. Mitesh, any thoughts? Uh, Escorts and uh, Mahindra and Mahindra. So, uh, Prashant on Mahindra and Mahindra, I think, you know, uh, one important observation which uh, every cadre needs to make is, uh, if you look at the last six months of data, uh, starting from uh, August of 22, we got a closing low of 12.26 and then, you know, on about 12 occasions that level is held and the 200 average is at about 12.24. So I think that becomes a very strong buying zone for M&M. Until that has been broken, um, we expect that the uh, level will keep giving the throwbacks. As courts, while the support level has you know, kind of given you a bounce back, I think a reversal will happen if we start getting past 21.50. So to be absolutely sure that the trend line is holding and the stock is ready to get into some kind of an up move, I would want to see it get past 21.50. All right. Uh, let's also get some 910 calls going now. Uh, in fact, m and is up almost about half a percent post the CLSA upgrade. So we'll talk more about that. By the way, the first uh, set of auto numbers are trickling in for the month of February. That's Escort sales looking pretty good, actually. Let's, we'll try and compare them to what they did last uh, month as well. But year on year, the numbers are looking good. It's a 27% growth that we're seeing in Escort. So that's the prima facie, the first number. Uh, at 7,811 units. But uh, Mitesh, what's the big call at 910 this morning? Well, I'll go with the buy on Berger Paints. Keep a stop below 569. 600, uh, 605 should be the target area. And, and uh, Sudarshan, how about you? Well, Ultratech Cement, that's a buy with a stop under 7160, 7160. Okay, thanks a lot for that. Uh, well, we'll see you guys.